This is a flexibility demonstration of the Gravity Series Multiconic. Here is the Multiconic undergoing pretty severe stress. Uh, I'm standing outside, uh, hanging from a rope, and jumping up and down on the uh, half inch shell of the conic, which is spanning 32 feet there. Here's a few shots to give you an idea of what this multi-conic actually looks like. Here it is uh, under construction. Uh, there are primarily four by four plywood sheets that are attached together with a three inch overlap, creating a huge sheet of plywood. Here's th this particular one going up. This one covers 1,050 square feet. It was put up in about eight days with a crew of eight and uh, a crew of four, excuse me. And uh, here's a, a shot of what it looks like today in its full configuration. Uh, it has yet to get the final coat of paint. This particular conic's been up many times, and uh, this is probably its final resting place, so we're going to uh, give it a nice coat of paint here soon. But you can see what it looks like from the interior, 1,000 square feet, completely usable space. We use it as our shop. And uh, here again is the flexibility test. And the big question is, what, what are these, these things going to perform like when, you, when they're under a severe load, like an earthquake or like severe winds? The, uh, one of the secrets is flexibility. The curves are another big secret to what's going on here. But as you can see, from a flexibility standpoint, these things can really move around. Under an earthquake, they would just jiggle like a bowl full of jelly. They're just not going to, uh, they're not going to fail in, in an earthquake because they can take tremendous deformation. It's like a huge trampoline built out of four by four sheets of plywood, making one huge sheet of plywood. That's what these conic structures are about, and that's what we hope this flexibility uh, demonstration is uh, is showing is just how flexible these these guys are, even without a wall. And it, we're also showing just how strong they are, being able to handle a 32-foot span. Thank you.